Come with me on this magical journey and let's discover the beauty of spirituality together. Mediumship is a powerful way to explore the realms of spirituality. Unlock inner wisdom and experience healing and expansion on a deep level. I am Suzanne Gill. I have been using my gift for years to connect with the divine and find spiritual truth. In my podcast, Insight, I'll share stories from my own journey as well as tips on how you can deepen your own connection relating to divine intuition. See the beauty in life through your rose-coloured lenses. Cultivate a positive outlook on what is possible and watch as nothing stands in your way to reach your success. I hope to bring you clarity, understanding and joy on your spiritual path and help you gain insight into the power of spirituality. Let's dive in. In each episode I'll explore topics such as developing your skills, creating soul connections and understanding how to work with spirit guides. I'll also provide practical tips on how to practice channeling safely, honorably and effectively so that you can take advantage of the wisdom available in this powerful life path. You'll also gain invaluable insight into the process of self-development and learn how to unlock your potential. Whether you're just starting out or have been a practice medium for a long time, this is the place to get answers to all your questions. You will also hear stories from my own life and experiences as a medium. From the first time I saw angels and earth spirits walk amongst us when I was a child, to the moments of deep healing and transformation, I will share it all so that you can gain insight and knowledge from my story as well. Join me as we explore the depths and strengths working with spirit together. By developing our intuition and learning to balance our thoughts, we will be able to tap into our inner wisdom and gain a better understanding of the divine. Everyone has the ability to unite with their guardian angels. The course of your life has led to where you are today because of your intuition. Whether you are on course and feeling control, or at the other end feeling loss of control. This is where the problem lies. It's only been the seldom few that listen to their intuition. This is where your life could change here and now. By following my guidance, I have been taught by the Divine Spirit, who has nurtured me through the times when I needed them most. This may be the answer you need to gain control of your own life. They do say, once the student is ready, the teacher will appear. The universe works in mysterious ways, and sometimes we must go through the hard times to appreciate the good moments. Trying times in my life had landed me at a crossroads. The only comfort I seeked was my guides and guardian angels. They gave me peace and understanding. We have to walk through a trial of life to learn from them. Trust your inner compass and make space for transformation. Open yourself up to the light that brings clarity, calmness and peace within you. Step into uncharted territories without fear, as guidance from something greater can often lead us towards unexpected moments of beauty in life. So be ready, find your balance. Now that we have explored the exciting journey of pursuing our spiritual path, Why not take this opportunity to deepen your understanding and find yourself inspired by a greater wisdom? Psychic people walk amongst us all, carrying a meaningful gift. Although some may be aware and use their abilities to help others, there are those who feel uncomfortable with themselves or uncertain of how to grow spiritually. The balance lies in understanding this, special ability should be shared, providing comfort and guidance through spiritual readings for their recipients. Feeling the warmth of helping and connecting with others is something remarkable. That energy that flows through your soul can help enhance you to reach greater heights. 
Even doors will open for you as a result. The world looks so much brighter when we know our guides are by our side. Lending us their support in all aspects life brings forward. By being more aware of your own capabilities, progress comes naturally while radiating and empowering light within yourself every step along your journey. Harness the power of your own energy with crystal work and gratitude practice. If you feel like a connection to divine light is slipping away, listen closely. It may be the time for self-care. Take moments each day to centre yourself in order to protect emotional resources from feeling depleted or overwhelmed. Most of the time we don't know where to turn from one direction to another if things seem muddled and unclear. Find balance within by counting all blessings that come along life's journey as an expression from deep appreciation. This will help you illuminate what path lies ahead. Just like going with the flow, that's what people say. It's easier to say than to do. Spiritual growth. Here is a tip to help you feel protected. Now before we do commence, please be aware, this is a slight form of meditation. It can only be used when you are centered, not around machinery or driving. Now imagine yourself surrounded by a blissful bubble filled with vibrant colors of a rainbow. These dazzling lights travel around your being, creating an etherical aura that only you can see in this very room and fills up with refreshing energy, protecting your spirit from outside influences. Try this every day you will feel the effects instantly. Asking your guardian angels for help and protection. Embrace transformation and find the courage to embrace uncertainty. Call upon your guardian angel for assistance. Create a sacred space, cleanse with sage and candlelight before asking them to draw closer. Allow yourself time to express all of your worries so that you may be heard by this benevolent protector. Visualize these words as glowing lights dissipating into nothingness after being sent outwards in peace. With practice, you can tap into divine intuition while simultaneously calming an anxious mind. Then trust the universe enough to move forward confidently on what path lies ahead. You will find the answer in due time. Your universe is listening. Crystals and healing are powerful tools to help you gain clarity, protection and peace of mind, enhancing positive energy. They can be a great way to find balance within ourselves by helping clear mental obstacles that may be blocking our progression in life. It's fascinating how many times we intuitively feel drawn towards certain crystals, even when they weren't intentionally on our radar. I always encourage everyone who is just starting out with this practice, try closing your eyes for a moment as you focus on your breathing. Ask yourself what colour or crystal I need right now. You might get an answer straight away, then write it down somewhere safe until the perfect time arises where you will have access to them precisely at the point when you need them most. Life is a funny way of making our dreams come true. If we take a chance and trust our instincts that guide us. Recently, while walking past the storm, I was drawn to an eye-catching dragon ornament sitting proud on its podium in the front window display. Without hesitation, for if believing deep down, this item had found me. To my surprise, the lady at the checkout hadn't even noticed it there before I pointed it out to her. Despite being at her post all day long, from then onwards, I kept reminding myself 
everything happens for good reasons. So don't be afraid to follow your intuition when something catches your attention. You never know what magical moments will arise from taking risks. Well, I hope this information helped you in any way. It's good to share. Over the next coming weeks, I will delve into more about how to become more open. And don't forget the balance. It's all part and parcel of life. I hope that this podcast has brought you some clarity, understanding and joy on your spiritual journey and helped you gain some insight into the power of spirituality. If you found it helpful, please share with your friends and family who may also be interested in learning more about this topic. And if you'd like to learn more about spirituality in general, please check out my newsletter where I post my new blog every week. Thank you for listening. See you all soon. Suzanne Gill